another review, and today it's going to be on the 2007 small size sets, the Hydruka, both of them. And I don't have the box, and this is, I'm actually, this is the second time I'm attempting this review, because the first time I thought I did not have the instructions, but it turns out I actually did have the instructions. So I'm restarting the review, to this time with the instructions. So, yeah. Anyway, let's start out with the blue Hydruka, Morak, here. So, first let's review the instructions. On the front you have Bionicle, Morak, set number 8932, Warning, Choking Hazard, who cares. You have Mahari Nui in the background. You have Morak firing his Zammer Sphere. I think it's actually an Air Sphere, actually. But still, it's the Zammer Sphere, really. But anyway, you have the Lego logo. On the back you have an ad for Bionicle Heroes, which was made a year before. You have an ad for the 2006 Bionicle.com, Lego customer service, and copyright 2007, the Lego group 4506990. Open it up, you have how to build him. Alright. That's finished product, it's telling you not to fire the Xamar Spheres at the face. And anyway, you have all the pieces that it comes with. And there you have an ad for the Baraki and www.bionicle.com. An ad for the Lego Club and that brick, yes, this brick was changed right here. But anyway, you have an ad for the Lego Shop at Home and those are the instructions for Morak, the Blue Hydruka. Alright, now let's move on to Morak himself. First off is the fact that, just, I just want to show you his Rakshi head, and yes, the Hydruka do have the Rakshi, use the Rakshi heads. First off is the fact that it's the little cross axle here, let me just zoom in, the cross axle here was slightly damaged when because I was using it for mocking. In fact, just today I made a mock of Lariska, the Dark Hunter, and I used this one, one, one of my two blue, this mask, this piece here, to mock with. And this cross axle was damaged, so it's kind, of, so it has a tendency to fall off. So, uh, what I, so what I do is I just push it on. Yeah. So see, it's, so see it's comes off really easily. So I kind of push it down a little more to just to anchor it on. Yeah, Alright. Head doesn't move up and down. It moves back and forth. You have this little claw here. And you have the Tachadox armor with a little red piece right there. Yeah, in fact, both of this Hydruka actually is one more, has one extra piece more than this Hydruka. It has because of this little claw here. Other than that, if it did not have this little claw right here, they would both have the exact same amount of pieces. But anyway, he has four legs, and you have this part rotates on both on a peg and a ball joint. And you have obviously pushed this here, and it fires the Zammer Sphere or Air Sphere, really, or whatever. So yeah, that is Morak, the blue Hydruka. And, alright, now let's move on to Thulox, the red Hydruka. Now, let's review the instructions first. On the front, again, you have Bionicle, Thulox, set number 8931. Warning, Choking Hazard, who cares? Lego logo. On the back, again, you have an ad for Bionicle Heroes. Lego Customer Service, www.bionicle.com, and copyright 2007, the Lego Group 4506989, only one number, one number away from the other one, but anyway, here you, here's how you build them, and both of them have the Mahari Nui in the background of the instructions, but, yeah, build him, and, yeah.
alright? Tells you don't shoot with the face and choking hazard again, who cares? And there you have all of his pieces and here's some writing here. That's just because of when I got this guy originally, this piece here, this little technique piece was not included. And actually it was given a the sim another version of this a different a different piece that was four long instead of three long. But a guy eventually managed to get the right piece from Lego Shop at home. And that's why there's writing on this part, just because of the packaging error. Really that was one of the only times I got a packaging error when I I have a few times gotten packaging errors in Lego sets, but I've never been able but that, that at that time it was either they accidentally put in extra pieces or they just yeah they just put in extra pieces but really that's the only time a major packaging error was made but anyway you have an ad for the Brocky and squid the squid ammo ads for the Lego club ad for shop at home and those are the instructions and yeah Anyway, now let's move on to Thulox himself. And first off is this this red Roxy mask really I really I didn't I'm not using as much as the blue Roxy mask for Morak. So it tends to be more stable. But still it comes off still very easily, despite the fact that I very rarely use it for mocking. But anyway, yeah. Anyway, anyway, the one thing different between Morak and Thulox is the color scheme. And yes, I know he's blue and he's red, but look, all four of Morak's legs are blue. Whereas only for Thulox, the two front legs are red, and the two black le back legs are black. So, on Morak, all four of the legs are the same color, whereas Thulox only... Some split half and half, two red, two black. But anyway, yeah. Anyway, and just like Morak having the Tachadox piece for the back, he has the Kalma piece for the back. And like I said, he's only he's one piece higher. Morak is the blue Hydruka is one piece higher. Really, the only reason why is because he has this little claw here in the back, whereas Morak. I mean, Thulox, whereas Thulox does not have the claw, whereas Morak does. So, yeah, but again, you have the same function where you have the turn here on the peg or on the ball joint. And again, you have the thing here, and I'm not going to fire it. The reason why is I just, I don't want it to get lost during the review. That's why I very rarely do I fire the weapons during the review it's just because it could get I'm worried it could get lost and I could spend a whole whole heck load of time during the review trying to find it and I don't want that to happen so yeah but anyway yeah anyway now it's time to rate them um, Morak both of them uh, Morak I rate a 7 out of 10 and Thulox I rate a 7 out of 10 both of them 7 out of 10 and I mean mo so yeah and yeah, these are actually for 39 and uh, 39 and 40 pieces. Yeah, that's their actual piece number. They are actually bigger than most of the small size sets. In fact, actually, the current Hero Factory sets, well, like the 2.0 styled sets, like Surge here, Surge 4.0, actually. Um, have just about the same amount of pieces as these two guys do. In fact, so, these guys may have, sometimes have even more pieces than the 2.0 sets. The 2.0 sets have like 30 pieces, whereas these guys have like, have more pieces than the 2.0 Hero Factory sets, which is actually kind of cool. So yeah, the, yeah, and even if, and so the, these guys cost less and you get even cost less than the 2.0 Hero Factory sets, and you get more pieces for better building experience. So yeah, I mean, it's actually pretty cool, actually. Lego is kind of stupid, but stupid in a good way for more pe more for less. But anyway, yeah. 
Anyway, 7 out of 10 for both of these guys, and this is Sign Ninja 444 signing off. And I recommend getting these guys if you can find them on eBay.